How would you describe the Crucible compared to other tournaments? It is a, a real endurance battle. I, I think it's not like any of the other tournaments. It's, it's very long. It's very tough to keep up that form for the, the whole 17 days. So you have to kind of pace yourself. You know you're not going to be at your best every single game. And it's kind of about just trying to get through the first couple of games and, and being able to maybe sustain your best form for, for the last week or, or, or something like that. So I think um, it's a different atmosphere. It's a lot more pressurised in the Crucible. Everyone's a lot closer to you. So it can either kind of make you or break you, I think. When you play well there, you're, you're on top of the world. There's a lot more eyes on that tournament than, than the rest of the calendar, so you have to use it as inspiration that this is your chance to kind of showcase what you got. Your earliest World Championship memory watching, what do you remember? I think I can remember the final with um, Peter Ebden and Stephen Hendry. I can remember kind of watching that one. I kind of remember Ken winning it. I think it was 97, maybe. That was really one of the first tournaments that I remember watching the World Championship being, being special on TV. I think the World Championship kind of creates drama that maybe no other tournament can create. There's always sort of instances of drama, but I think the World Championship really brings out some sort of nail-biting games. Looking back at your own experience there, what do you remember from your debut? I started off OK against Sean and just kind of ran out of momentum. I, I kind of remember being very tired in the second session. At that point, I didn't really know how to pace myself over the, the longer format. So I think I got a bit too excited in the first session and, and, and burnt out. Your champion, Judd Trump. I'd probably say it's a different feeling than any other title I've won. Just the, the whole weight of the world lifted off your, off your shoulders, I think, after you win that first title. So there's always... Um, Maybe that doubt in the back of your head until you do it, and is is a incredible feeling when you do do it. It'd be amazing to to win another world championship or or, or more than one. But I just want to win as, as many titles as possible. If they happen to be world championship, then that would be incredible. But for me, I'm just so determined to, to win as many tournaments as I can before I retire.